Hey everyone, Brian here, and welcome back to a new video. Once again, we are playing the one and only Grass BTD, aka F them Afghans. Um, I'm not sure what he means by that, but I'm not going to comment. So this is tournament rules. So um, there is no. Heli farm NG. Um, there is certain maps banned, certain things banned. I'm assuming he's going heli farm ice, but I guess we'll see. Um, yeah, he's probably going heli. I should probably place an NG up here. Um, yes, yes, we do. We place an NG up there. So offside. What should I do? <clears throat> <clears throat> hmm. I think if he sends me pinks, I'm gonna go for a nine incher. Send some blues and some pinks. There's like something on my desk. Okay, we good. Okay, so he's gone for a quad dart, which is good. Um, I might sell this. Nope. I'm gonna upgrade to a nine incher and put this on last. Close. Close is probably the play here. Yep, it is first, and we should up, um, catch these leaks. Go for a plantation over here, and I think I'm gonna go for a sentries, uh, a sentry gunner. Okay, so our plan is to just anti-stall as hard as possible. What's he doing down there? Okay, I probably can't really send him anything too big. I think we just farm really hard. Since we're probably out farming him. Yep, we are out farming him. But he does have the better late game uh, towers. Mm, okay. Okay, what's he doing? He's being slightly aggro, which is fine. Close. I don't really think that does anything it, um since it doesn't stall the rounds i don't really leak that much and he hardly forces any defense i'm gonna go for my plantation now yeah i think that was kind of a dumb rush on his part unless if he's gonna follow it, it up with anything i'm gonna um tower boost him some yellows try to force a rotors or something and and I'm going to try to farm hard here, because rounds 9 to 13 are the fastest rounds. And I want to try to accumulate as much money as I can in those rounds. It's, it's a bit unfortunate, actually, because those are the rounds where I need to have my balloon trap up. Which kind of takes away from a bit of the income that I would have received. Um, I'm not sure what his third tower is. I'd really, I'd really like to know. It's probably not ice because he would have would have started with an ice. Maybe ace. I don't know. Oh, it's it's oh it's heli. Wow. Okay, I'm not sure how good this this zero one upgrade is, but I've greeted as hard as I could from rounds nine to round thirteen. Because those rounds are, are the rounds where you get the money, the big money. Okay, so do we go for a BIA now? I'm not sure how good is his loadout is, but I think if we go for a BIA and he can't force us to sell it, it would be pretty OP. I'm not gonna go for it yet. Maybe next round. Since he could probably force a sell r really easily. So let's go for our BIA this round. I am thinking that I can probably all out him 
round 18. Because, because since I've just upgraded to a BIA, he's not gonna expect me to have the, to have that much money. But I actually probably would have had like 7k cooked up, I can probably cash this for 5k. So I'm gonna have 12k to, to send him Camo Regro Rainbows. And he's gonna have to guess an Apache to defend, I believe. So, so let's do that. With some leads, he's probably not gonna sell me anything. And let's cash this out and go for a bunch of rainbows. And he has to Apache here, okay, great. Okay. I shouldn't have sent that much actually, but I would have assumed he would have, like I was scared in case he would have um, defended that rush because he is known f for doing some pretty OP things. Like last time he defended it with his rotors and NG, but we'll see what happens here. Is he gonna send me a BFB? Probably not. I think if he sends me a BFB, he's gonna drain his eco. He's gonna drain everything. So, so he probably can't afford to send me that. And if he does, I can just sell this easy peasy. He might try to layer in something, but I, but I just doubt it. To be honest, well done. Is he gonna try to layer in something? He is. Let's just boost this. And we'll say well done. So he does not have a stall. And he has upgraded to like around 20 BIA I think. He has... Two more boosts. Same as me. But he does not have a stall. He he does not have a stall. We are out farming. I think we have this game in the bag. But this guy is pretty OP. So nothing's really guaranteed with him. I might go for a second bloom trap here, especially especially since he's trying to layer stuff into. Uh, we probably can't cash out here. I'm I'm gonna cash out on like round twenty three. Hmm, probably not. If he sends me. A Moab now, I can just sell a Bloom Trap for Jitsu. I have three spikes anyway. Do I sell this for my extra bananas? Probably not. I would lose... How much would I lose, actually? If I sold that. So that's like... Um, 450 plus 450 plus like 650 plus 350 plus... I would lose like... I would lose about 1.5k, which is too great so in some circumstances it, is, it, is, it might be worth this but usually not i mean i can think of a situation round 22 where it would be useful but i would also need a bloom trap for defense and extra money too so probably not worth this okay i'm gonna have to upgrade to a third bloom trap um, on round 25 and I can cash this one out and sell it next round too. So let's do that and go for our third bloom trap. So we are out farming him by one factory. Let's sell these sentries so I can make more money. Now is it worth in is it worth it to send him a so oh my god? I might just send one. Uh, I don't know. I mean we outstall him anyway. But I really don't want to ruin my ego, yes. Shh I, I, I don't really know. Probably not. I probably don't send this. I, I think I just try to out farm him. Out farm him as much as possible. back 
Okay, so let's try to outfarm him as much as possible. And I'll... Well, I don't really have to rush him. His farms are, are kind of shit. And... And we and we can probably um, defend a, a pretty big rush if he sends one to us. Like we're up two two factories, two or one factories. It's probably just one factory. Yeah, only one factory. But we're we're gonna be making more from from these balloon traps, and we have more eco than him too. I'm gonna start sending now, and I'm gonna send a fast cooldown one. Because I probably should have rushed them around 27. And it's only like 10k difference and a bit of eco. Or is it the same amount of eco? I'm not entirely sure. Not really too important, I think, anyway. Okay. So let's try to force some defense now. On his end. And let's also try to, try to continue farming. I might try to get more bloom traps because these are because they are giving me quite a lot of ula. Some more bloom traps. So I have four bloom traps. I'm gonna I'm gonna need a sabo for round thirty two. Okay, so he has started his rush now. I should be okay here. And I should probably. Keep on farming too. Upgrade to more jitsu. It's like, we, we, like we are, we are gonna need this defense later anyway. So, so I think my plan is to not really rush him too much, since we can win a late game anyway because we have a stall, and he does not. So let's do this. I th I think we should be okay here. We have like twenty bloom jitsus. I'll be shocked if it's not enough. Let's upgrade to more factories. He has quite a bit of factories actually. How many does he have? He has twelve. We have thirteen. Okay, so he has so he has quite a bit. Is he starting his rush now? I don't know. I mean, we're probably fine here. Nope, we are we are not fine. We're we're going to have to counter. Since I don't want him to like send me infinite. Okay, we are fine here for sure. We are fine here. He is not though. Are, are we good? Micro, micro, micro. Damn. Are we good here? Why does he still have like 20 facilities left? This th th this guy is so good, holy. Hopefully our our um, bloom traps are gonna give us some money. Grab some distraction on that. And it's a pretty big thing here because he does not have stall. He does not have stall. Damn, I don't think we can I don't think we can defend this, can we? Well done, man. I think he has won.
boom 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 we might be able to like outstar them but I doubt it and we still have a boost Are we dead here? Bro, please. Whew. Th this is gonna be really close. Though I think he's okay. I think he's okay there. Bro, Sabo. Damn. He, he, he defends that flawlessly. Is he okay? Is he dead? Ooh, Jesus, bro. Fair play. Fair play. So, Heli Farm. Heli Farm Village. What a strategy. What a strategy. I think I'm, I think I'm gonna have to practice my losing map. Swan Lake. Always has been a, always has been a great losing map. Yeah, but on that offside game, man, what could I have done differently? Or just NFE not win? I think if I sent him a sum I got a bit earlier, he would have less money. Because the money the money difference doesn't really mean that much when everyone has infinite money anyway. So I think that's probably one possible... Um, one possible possibility. I'm, I'm going to have to test that though I mean I probably won't but that is one possibility why oh he's bro he's hardly going heli village here no Ooh, damn, we have leaked quite a bit of lives. Okay, so close. I don't think he can greet here. Yes, he does not. I think our spot is better for pinks than his one is. He's probably okay, so he's upgraded to his faster shoes then. Bruh, but why is he over defending so much? I think he's used two spikes now, so so we're basically just out farming here. What's his, what's his third tower? I mean it's probably mortar. I don't really see any other good strategies. Heli pilot might be decent. Actually, no it's not, it's shiz. And if he went boomer, he would probably be be anti Stalin quite a loss. So I'm guessing he's, he's going both farm and mortar. The play here is probably BIA. Oops, I shouldn't have just upgraded that. Um, are we dead here? I normally place my boat spots here, but that spot would just chase way too much. Which is why I've gone for this spot up here. He hits us. He hits us with the bloom boost. So let's place this one here, and we should be all good. We should be all good. We should be all good here, indeed. And let's just go for our plantation. He probably can't send us yellows, surely, right? I mean, if he does, I just upgrade this to a grape shot, and we vibin. We are vibin. Round 9 rush? Probably not. Let's just keep farming. So, I think the play here is to try to go for a, a bank as early as possible. Or a BIA. A, a BIA is probably better.
I'm just gonna greed since he has no money now. Bro, greens, what? Bro, why is this one unstrong? Okay, we sh should be okay here. Let's send him a few blacks. Okay, so we forced a destroyer and we got our eco up. Close, close. What's he gonna do here? Okay, so he's gonna farm on. I'm just gonna mirror him. Bruh, I swear that this upgrade was 1500s. Probably got a price nerf. Okay, so he's going for his bank. I'm gonna match that. I I missed a bit of ego, but it's fine. Now, do I rush him? Probably. Are we good here? We are barely good. And he chokes like an idiot. Nah, I'm just joking. I love you, Grass. But I think he was focusing on my screen and he didn't see his screen because it was fairly obvious he, he was choking. But let's see. Okay, it looks like he has DC'd or something, so I'll see you guys in the final game. Okay, guys, and we're back. So this is going to be probably our last match because I have to go somewhere. So this is just going to be a best of three pr rather than a best of five. I mean, this is still um, this is still a lot better than the usual BFB Arena Bustoni BS. But now we have found the server thanks to Afghanistan, aka AFG, for making this server where there's actually good rules. There's tower bans, there's only good maps, no Dread Bloom Cave losing map BS. So I'm really happy about that. So he's going heli, okay. Interesting. Um I don't think he can eco because eco is banned. Thank God. But yeah, okay, so he's just trying to avoid like um leaking lives. I respect that. So I've noticed a few things about how how um grass plays. He doesn't like leaking lives. He plays quite aggro. He likes to be in control of of the game. He usually has one game plan and he sti and he sticks with it the whole game. So he's a fairly um OP player, I'd say. Let's just say he's a very solid player who's who's hard to beat. So let's go for my grape shot now on close. And do I send him some balloons? Probably not. I think my plan here, since since we're out farming him, is is to go for like a really early BIA. And when he matches, I can punish him. I'm assuming he has heli farm village again. And on the first game, we've all seen how, how overpowered the the MIB call to arms ability is. So I'm pretty confident that if NFE loses to the to to that, both farm mortar also loses. Well, I mean, on maps like Water Hazard, it probably doesn't lose, or Riverside. Mm, it might be interesting on Riverside, but on most maps, it's fairly solid. Okay, what is he doing? So he's sending us some blacks. Two, two uh, grape shots on close is probably fine. And we have no spikes left, which is a bit annoying, but it's fine. 
No. <coughs> now, do we send them some yellows here? Or do we farm? I think farming is, is the move. We have like a thousand more dollars than he does. Which is nice. I'm gonna go greed here actually. And go for a plant. Since we're now a plantation ahead of him. Is he gonna farm? He is indeed he is indeed gonna farm. And we can't bank before round thirteen. Which is which is one of the rules. I mean it's it's before round fourteen. Which is a great rule, I think. Thanks to AFG who made that rule. Okay, so he's doing good now. Okay. I'm gonna up I'm gonna have to upgrade to a signal flare. Fuck. He's actually sending us. Bruh, fuck. Fuck me. Yeah, I'm pretty crying right now. That's 50 more eco that I missed. Out on. It's all good though. I think, yeah. We have more money than him. I can probably send him a small rush. He's gonna go for his BIA soon, I think. So I'm gonna send him a small, a small rush here. Is he dead here? Is he dead? Oh damn, he, he was almost dead, wasn't he? What can we do, bro? What can we do? Oh, okay. He... He um, doesn't have a BI. Okay, okay. That's where we have our, our lead. He he did not upgrade to his BIA. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Fuck. We have no play here. We have no play. Okay. Boys, what's our play? We have no plan. Think, Brian, think. Mm, okay, BFB round 20 for sure. Hopefully, okay, so if he doesn't upgrade to his Apache, I can layer really, really hard. Now the question becomes, can he afford an Apache? I mean, he has village. It's gonna be pretty close. Apache is still fourteen hundred, I think, or is it sixteen hundred? I'm not quite sure. Okay, he probably has around eight k, so he can probably afford this. Unfortunately, um, let's bloom boost the BFB SM. Bro, what is he sending? Hopefully that thing slows down. Yeah, we have to boost this. 100%. Okay, so it looks like he he's gonna try defending this without cash and ass. Fuck, he has like a jungle drums. Hopefully, he, hopefully he just dies here. Please die here, bro. Please die. Please die. No PS tower boost. Bro, why is he so good? Okay, okay.
Are we dead here? Probably have to boost this. Okay. So, so I have to send him a semi god here. I think that's our only play left. I mean, if he if he all outs us right now, we're, we're probably we're probably dead. No boosts, no money. So we are hoping for a choke here. I think he still has all all. No, he only has one more tower boost. Um, that's for sure. I think we have to all out him. We don't really have much choice here. Let's go f full send. Full send to him. And some leads too. I think he's okay, but who knows? He might... He, he might pull out an Asian choke station. If we are lucky. I'm pretty sure we are dead to the round 25 AI too. And he still has a boost too. Bro. Die. Moabs, let's go, let's fucking go. Moabs, do your shit. Oops. Damn. Heli Farm Village might be the new meta, honestly. So anyway, guys, I'm gonna have to work on that. I think on water maps, both farm, both farm, farm mortar still wins, like on on Ghostly Coast, Swan Lake. But on maps like Village, like on land maps, offside with farm village. Mm. There might be some way, if I'm aggro enough, that I can stop him from farming too hard. But I'm going to have to have a think about that. And do some testing. Because the monkey force is, is pretty OP. And MIB call to arms is, man. That's just really good. Mm, okay. I actually want to want to test something. Um, does Sandbox still exist? Okay, it does, it does. So, I'll, I'm just going to test on offside. Um, offside. I want to compare Heli with and, and without the, the, the village. So, let's start off with this. And let's send a uh, Moab class bloom. It's gonna follow it the whole way around, and we'll see how much damage it does. Okay, so it has thirty six pops. Now let's do the same with a um, with the monkey fort. It should probably. Pop us earlier. Okay, so it has like it has more than double the amount of pierce. Is it pierce or or um damage? I'm not sure. Like zero one, like they both they both popped around here. So I think it's pierce, not damage so it's pierce so this has a lot more pierce now now let's try this with jungle drums what does this look like? oh wrong upgrade now let's try jungle drums and see how it does so this is monkey force and jungle drum so it has more more um attack speed now and also more pierce Okay, so it like it it is effectively triples the amount of damage. Let's see what happens if it's a jungle drum only. I'm expecting around seventy something pops, but we'll see. We'll see here. 
Oh. I didn't sell it, did I? Let's try that again. Oops. Um, how to clear screen, guys? I don't know. So, okay. So I'm expecting 70 something pops, as I said. Let's see if that's the case. Sixty, okay. So, so Monkey Fort does a pretty op op job against us. Now let's see an Apache. An Apache um against the BFB. Let's see how much better it does. Okay, so. So without it, pops around here. Let's see what happens if I bring Monkey Fort into the action. Okay, so so Monkey Force definitely cleans it up a lot faster. And let's try with Jungle Drums too. Shreds. Okay, which is even faster too. How about if I have MIB call to arms? Can that defend one single, so my god, and boost? Where's the boost here? Is this the mega boost though? I hope not. Um, bro. Just shoes the thing. Okay, good. So this and this is it is it is it gonna shred? Damn, bro, that shreds that shreds so much. That shreds. So it can defend an entire. So oh my god. Well, I guess this ability is twenty k anyway. So, but this might be a really good strategy. There's probably something I'm missing mid game, but Grass is a very good player, so wouldn't be too surprised if this was in fact the true Mesa. Anyway, guys, th thanks for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in my next in my next competitive series. Peace.